Yeah, I was like, yo, bro. And yo, check this, bro. He was all like, if you know, you know, bro. And you know what I said? <laughs> bro! Yeah, hi. Um, Tess? Yo! Whoa, I have not seen this many racers in one place in a minute. Brought everyone back out. The love of racing, bruh. The need to express oneself behind the wheel. And money also. Yeah, probably money. I forgot how much I missed this. <laughs> I can see why. I'm gonna do the rounds, figure out what's up. Thanks for the lift, Speedy. How many years has it been, for real? The man cracks down a little bit and we all bitch out? Flex in with your super tuners and your muscle cars. That guy. Woo! What's it gonna take, huh, to remind you why we got into this? Stacks. Nailed it. Three qualifiers, high risk. You have a run-in with the cops, you take them on. You make it, and I will see you in the finals. The Lakeshore Grand. You want to win? Then you had better be the best. Seven days into the first qualifier. Earn your place. Yes. Yo, Speedy. You still want that five-star rating? Then show me what you got. Five stars? I got you. This is it. Ride those rides. Not bad. I think he's a little work. <laughs> so, this is where Yaz started off, huh? Get the hell out of my shop! Wasn't me! Whoa, whoa! Kid? You triggered the alarm, sister. Hey, no touching. Sorry, this is Tess. I almost took your head off. Nice to meet you, Slugger. Right on. I saw Jasmine. She just rolled up at this meetup. You kidding? She still had the car. And she's still with that same crew that jacked our garage, setting up some high-stakes circuit called the Lakeshore Grand. <laughs> Corny. With our car. I need to beat her. I need the garage. I need your help. Hold on, kid. Now, let's say you do this, OK? And you throw down with Jasmine, and you beat her in a street race. So what? So what? That's what this garage was about. Now look at this place. We're fine. This yours? Didn't I say no touching? Mr. Rides of Rydell's Rides. Love that name, by the way. Full disclosure. I went to that meetup tonight looking for a racer. Then the cops showed up and I was like, cops. <laughs> oh yeah. And the kid was crazy fast out running him. Now, I'm thinking, learn from the best. Listen, I got what you need, cash. And you two got what I want, a reason to win. How about I make an investment in this garage, rep you in the race, maybe open some doors. Come on, Rydell. I can win. We can bring this place back. I'm in. Woohoo! Just promise me, no matter what Jasmine does, you do it the right way. Deal? Deal. So, Rydell, got any rides out back? Welcome to Rydell's Rides. <laughs> First qualifier, baby. This place is lit. Hey, Speedy, check it. Looks like Yaz is going down tonight. Today's your lucky day. Perfect. Time to show her up. Wait. What is she doing? Looks like she's racing, but not in her car. I mean, your car. I mean, why? Why Why would she swap cars? My guess? 
It's her chance to size you up without risking her ride. Don't let her throw you. Go kill it, Speedy. Oh, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? Get in that car. You guys never backs down from a challenge, right? Hey, yo, yes. What's up? Long time. Yo, is that my car? Yeah. One you stole. The same night you ripped off the garage. <laughs> Damn! Uh, I know you're not coming at me right now. Rydell trusted you. Yeah? Well, I never asked him to. I never needed any of that fake father shit. I can handle myself. <laughs> this is great. That right? Let's see it. Me and you, race right now. Winner gets the car. Yeah, let's race for pinks! Pinks? What is this, the 50s? Tess, stop filming. You kidding me? Two long lost friends turned rivals throwing it down in the underground over some daddy drama. A stolen car. Next thing you know, this guy takes off his shirt. It goes to blow someone out of tunes this shit and BAM! We're on the Breakfast Club. Don't post that. It's a live stream. You know what, Pinks? I'm feeling a little generous. Charitable. You make it to the finals, you're on. Winner gets the car. <laughs> if you make it. Still two qualifiers left. It's cool. I waited two years. What's a few more years? She can't back out now. No need to thank me. Hey, hey, don't feel bad. Your money is safe with me. Yo, Tess, what's up? What's up? People love betting over stupid drama. That's what's up. <laughs> My post of you and Yaz beefing is blowing up. I am pulling in likes. I am pulling in subs. I am pulling in stats. <laughs> betting on me? Well, not just you. I never bet on just one horse. Hold up. You, you betting against me? Oh, don't get all sensitive, Speedy. I know you got what it takes to win this whole thing. But what's the harm in throwing down on some other racers? If you win, we make money. If you lose, we still make money, huh? You got me? Yeah, I got you. But who's really running these books? Oh, I like the way you think. That Alec guy who set up the race? Same guy taking the bets, which means He'll do anything to come out on top. What are we gonna do about that? Like I told Rydell, I'm here to win. Ooh, I felt that. Good, this is good. I got some ideas on how we can get some more of that, so get yourself an Italian beef and focus up. I'll hit you up later. Everybody here is throwing down on you or Jasmine for the Lakeshore Grand. So how much are we putting down on me? <laughs> About that. Let me float you something. Where's Jasmine? Oh, hey! Hi. What are you doing? Oh, you made it to the finals. Guess you're finally ready to lose to me. This, this is what I'm talking about. People love in this drama, huh? Mm, thanks to you, Pinks. Yes, thanks to me. But you know what's better than drama? A surprise ending. But what if you didn't try to win, huh? What? I'm here to help bury the hatchet, you two. Check it. Alec wants to cut us all in on a deal to fix the final race. What's this bullshit? You think I'd really throw in with her and her crew after what she did? Remember why you got into this. Stacks, right? Look around. The real money's in the gambling now. Who cares about winning the race? Besides, if one of you crosses that finish line first, your boss is gonna lose a lot of money on these bets. And you know better than me what he thinks of losing. You know, you better dip before I tell Alec about this shit you're trying to pull. Just the messenger, girl! You sure you know him? <laughs> <laughs>
I ain't throwing shit. Shut up. That one well. Never bet on just one horse, huh? Don't screw this up for us. Think about Rydell. Don't talk to me about Rydell. We're done. I told you how this works. I open doors and we make money. This was that door, bruh. This was that door. Yes, absolutely. We're dropping a fortune to stop us. All right, shut up, shut up, shut up. This is it. Woo! Now check your phones for the starting line, huh? Now I'm gonna be real. Five O knows something's going down. They'll be out tonight. That's not gonna stop you, right? Hey, it's time for the late show grand corny everybody loves an underdog oh yeah how's Alec? broke fam thanks to you i'm lost why, why do you sound happy oh did i give you the impression that i work for Alec? <laughs> how many times do i have to tell you speedy you never bet on just one horse when I win, I win. When I lose, I still win. Learn from this, Jasmine. Loyalty's overrated. Nah, it's not. Yo, bro, can I get a ride? <laughs> <laughs> 